early afternoon everyone welcome back to my channel in case you guys haven't noticed I have changed my channel name <laughs> when I first started my channel a year ago it's going on a year um I found what I thought was fitting for what I do which was bargain hunting so I decided to call my channel Elsa the bargain hunter as you guys know me um, this morning I woke up and I said, you know what? There's been a change in my lifestyle. And um, my one year anniversary is coming up in June. And I think there should be a change to my channel. So I have decided and um, I went ahead and changed it to Elsa, the bargain hunting crafter. <laughs> I have a new passion for crafting and I found that name fitting. I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? It works for me or doesn't work for me? Stick to the old routine. I don't like old routines. I like changes. <laughs> I am on here uh, with one of my two videos for the day. I do have actually maybe three videos. I'm not sure yet. Um, I do have um, project share vid videos to do with you guys for um, L Beads. Um, I did a unboxing for them last week or the week before. And um, I've been working on their projects uh, since Monday, I think. And I'm um, not done yet, but I'm getting there. As you guys can see, I am very tired. <clears throat> it's been a painful few days. Um, though the weather has been nice, it's just my body's not cooperating with me. So I have the bags and the puffiness and everything and anything possible. But <clears throat> I do want to do this, these videos. And I wanted to do a quick two item, believe it or not. Actually, four items, but two of the items I'm not showing because they're a surprise um, for some friend mail. Um, so I'm not showing those two items. Actually, it was six items. Bag of chips and some Kleenex. Yeah, but then the other two items I set aside. Um, I'm sure I have some because during my um, <clears throat> crafting challenge, I was gifted a lot of it. I just can't find it right now because there's a mess downstairs as I'm in the process of moving stuff around. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I said instead of stressing myself out trying to find it, let me just go to Dollar Tree. So um, I did find it at Dollar Tree, thank God, because I really need it. Uh, I've been doing a lot of crafting lately, a lot of creations, and um, I've been using a lot of it. So what I found is the 20-piece glue sticks the mini glue sticks I want to say these are the mini ones yeah they are perfect okay uh, the 20 piece uh, glue sticks I know I have some downstairs somewhere but I I'll stress if I go down there trying to look for them because there's like um you know those collapsible containers I have a lot of them and I try to sort them out like one collapsible container for adhesives one for stickers one for, but then I start to crafting and I just start throwing stuff everywhere so it's it never stays organized so I don't want to stress myself out so I grabbed a pack of these the 20 piece I also grabbed I seen this last week and I said those will come in handy you never know you can never go wrong with a pack of permanent markers um I decided on the three pack of all different colors the blue red and black because what am I going to do with three black ones? I never know if I want to use a red one or I need a blue one or I need a green one. So I said, you know what, let me just go ahead and grab the three pack with all three different colors. That way I have them. So I grabbed this. So I hope I've never used the permanent markers from Dollar Tree. So I'm hoping it'll work good. I'll let you guys know. But these are the big markers. All three colors. Permanent. So I am... Hobby's always looking for a marker, so this is coming handy. It sounds like my mother in law is doing something next door, so if you guys hear some banging, it's her. So I got this. So that was it for the Dollar Tree, and I also want to share some winnings. Um, I want to say it was two weeks ago, I started following. Well, prior to this video, I was I had just started following um the Crafty Sensei. And her name speaks for itself. She um, she does most of her videos, the tutorials, tutorials, I don't know how to say the word, 
uh, on her creations. And in this particular video, she did a tutorial on a chunky charm and it came out beautiful. But then at the end of the video, she announced a giveaway on the tutorials that of the charms, the chunky charms that she had said on the video. So, um, we placed our comments. I don't know exactly what we were supposed to put, but anyway, we placed our comments and when she announced the winner, I was one of them. I want to say there was two winners and I was one of them. And I was super excited because the charm she did on the previous video with the giveaway announcement, the tutorial for the chunky charm was amazing. I'm going to show you guys that, but first she um i got it yesterday it came all the way from canada if you follow me on instagram you would have seen it on instagram because i did post it yesterday uh, <coughs> i didn't record any videos because i was just anyway it's crazy um so it came all the way from canada so i've already unwrapped it and she put in there the card. i love this card by the way the card says you are amazing i love that and then in the back it has a butterfly on the card it's not even attached it's on the card i love this card and inside she wrote elsa congrats on winning the charm i hope you like it i do <laughs> your crafty friend xo joan the crafty sensei and then it says p.s take care and stay safe sweetie you too things are getting better here they are slowly opening up businesses um in phases uh phase one uh i forgot the way of the, it went sorry but i know that michael's will be opening soon and i just found out joanne fabrics um not far from here um is doing curbside pickup so i'm excited just gotta wait to get paid to make a stop um actually i gotta wait to get paid and see what i need first i do not want to overload myself with any craft of items paper die cuts i don't mind adhesives i don't mind because i've been doing a lot of cards lately so the more paper i have the more production i can get done so i don't mind that i just don't want too much of the uh just i don't know i'm sure there's going to be too much of something i just don't want to overdo it <laughs> um so along let me get back to this along with the card came a memdex card that she made and this is beautiful i love it I'm not going to show the back because that's where her information is. But look at the swan on the heart. Is this crepe paper on the swan on the heart? The butterfly. The cat. This is like a gumball machine. I love that. And then it says, the light of my life. This is so stinking cute. And then it has her information in the back. I just realized your date of birth Joanne, which is June 7th. It's my YouTube anniversary date. <laughs> oh, your favorite colors are black, pink, gold, and mint. I'm in with the pink, gold. Maybe the mint. I mean the black and gold. Maybe the mint. And pink. Um, I have two twin granddaughters. And um, my daughter, like I've said before, has never been girly girly. And I don't think the girls will be either, but we'll see. So I got to start phasing over the pink. So I thought this was really, really cute. Thank you. And then, guys, the charm is amazing. She's packaged it, added a bag topper. Look at the back. I love that sticker. Made with love, the crafty sensei. I would love to know where you got those stickers from. I have stamps. I just don't, you know. My penmanship is horrible. But look at this, guys. Isn't that... I haven't taken it out of the bag. I don't want to take it out of the bag. But isn't that beautiful? I absolutely love this. And she showed us how to make it. So I'm in the process of getting the little um, hooks there. I want to get those. So I can start making my own. I love this. Look at that heart. A lot of bling in that. So in the back, she decorated. It has all our information. A lot of you guys have my information anyway. But it has. Look at all this washi paper. I love it. The oh, I just showed you. Sorry. 
So yeah, guys, I am excited. I have another chart, and I'm going to dissect it and um, learn from that aside from the tutorials. tutorials. So I'm going to attach the Crafty Sensei's um, channel link in the description box below for you guys to go check her out. And stay tuned for my next video. You guys are going to be excited. Um, it's a must-watch-to-the-end type video. And uh, we'll get into that later. Talk to you guys later. Bye.